Hey guys, welcome to the Manga Mark channel. Today I am watching One Piece, but I'm watching a special uh, thing here that's on Netflix, uh, which is apparently the anime adaptation of the... was it like a one-shot that Oda did before One Piece? Uh, which I believe is the story of Ryuma, who is the samurai that we met as a zombie and thriller back so i'm very interested to see this um because i i haven't checked out the uh the manga yet of this because like people told me this was coming so i'm excited to see it especially because it's like it's a newer thing and it's going to be newer animation because at, at the story right now in one piece as people that watch the channel will know I am. I have just seen. I'm on Fishman Island. I have just seen the flashback of Fisher Tiger and uh, Queen Otohime there. So this is very exciting because, like, if as I don't know if this is canon. If you guys could, uh, I think it is. I think it is because they they referenced it in Thriller Back. They spoke about Ryuma and what he did. And people told me then that that was reference to this. Um, so I don't know actually how how long ago this will take place. Uh, but you know, like as as much as I uh, may have given given Thriller Bark a hard time compared to other arcs because of some of the characters that I'm not going to get into. Uh, but Ryuma was a was a high point for me. Um, even as a zombie, I thought it was, it was great. So very excited to see him when he was alive. Like, because obviously in Filler Bark, because he had Brook's shadow, it kind of took on his personality. So let's see what he was actually like, guys. Um, excited to see it. Uh, guys, if you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. Everyone that has comes back, watches, comments, likes all these videos. Thank you guys so, so much. I really appreciate it. And yeah, let's do this. One Piece Monsters. Let's go. Is it... Is that Zoro's voice actor? Yeah. Yeah, that's definitely Zoro. Okay. Let's do this. Okay. Hey, right. this guy looks like one of the the musketeers. So where are we? I thought because it was Ryuma, it was going to, we were going to see Wano. But is that, is that is that not this place? Oh, there it's there, that's the sword. Yeah. Oh, what was his name again? Shusui. Shusui, that was it. Yeah. Oh, God. I like that he, I like that he kind of looks like Zoro as well. Um... I don't know if that's, if Oda's maybe just kind of, because I know that there's different things like the one shots he did, but like obviously Luffy's grandfather used to be uh, in it as well, so the designs kind of moved and changed depending on the One Piece world. Oh, is he getting beat here? Okay, this guy's the real deal, okay. Oh. I'm going to guess that's a bad guy. Okay. I don't think this Shirano guy was mentioned in the series, if I'm right. Maybe it will be. But not at the point I'm at. Ah, 
Oh, that was the girl from the from the bar. Okay. What's this guy doing? So he was pretending that Rima stabbed him? Why? What? I don't know what this guy's motives are here. Is it actually... Yeah, is it actually that though? This guy, is, uh, it seems shady as hell, so I don't know what what his deal is here. Oh, oh, it's that guy. Okay. Is this guy going to be a bad guy? Maybe not. Hmm. I don't even like what country is this? Has it been stated? Did I miss that? I know they're talking about the king. The king is classed as the world's greatest swordsman, but it looks like a it looks like a western kind of town. Oh, oh yeah, don't, don't call him a sleep. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that, I knew it, I knew it. I, I knew it. I knew this. Yeah, I could sense it. There's, there, was, there was something shady. Yep. Oh, God. Yeah, that's painful. Oh god, okay. But so then is he actually a like a good swordsman? Cause he managed to like surprise Ryuma in the bar. So his skills seem actually like the real deal then? Okay. So they just killed everybody and pretended it was the dragon then. Oh. Like this guy gave me bad vibes, right? But the other guy, like so, some designs in one piece, you can just tell. <laughs> You're like, right, you are going to be a scumbag. He's, Oda is a master as well of the, the celestial dragons. Every celestial dragon that you see, <laughs> you know they're going to be scum. Oh my god, their parents were still alive? Oh no, this guy. Oh no way, man. Okay. Okay, well, you know, she's... She gathered herself a lot quicker than expected. You know, she's strong. Or she just want to get alone and then break down. Yeah. Put a brave face on it there. Yeah, that's tough. Okay. Let's go, Ryuma. Let's do this. Okay, let's do this. Yeah, you don't look like <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. 
Okay, so he's just, yeah, he's, he's just blowing all out. He's just revealing all. Okay. Oh. Oh, I like that. Okay. Yes. You're up against the real deal now. <laughs> yeah, big mistake. <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, so his skills were actually the real deal. But... Oh, crap, right, okay. Yeah, you can't, f you, you, your, your threats mean nothing to this guy. So, you know, oh God, right, okay. I hope that the girl gets out of there and tells the people about, you know, the truth. Yeah. Oh my. Let's go. Oh, what's this music? Let's go, man. I love that. I love that when it goes black and white, the animation change. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. There you go. Dragon. Done. Yeah. That's where the legend of Ryuma began. Yeah. Say the name. Say the name. Ryuma D. King? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Oh, we're at, oh okay, we're actually getting the front park. God. Yes. Oh man, yeah, that, that means a lot more now coming from Zoro when you think about it. Yeah. Oh, God. Oh, that was good. <laughs> right. I I love that. I love that. Just a nice, short, simple story. Um, and it, just, it fully conveyed, you know, it gave you enough to get a hold of, like, Ryuma's character. Ryuma's character and how much of a badass he was. Right? So he's basically, the way he was kind of phrased it, he was basically the world's greatest swordsman, right? Of that time. Um, I, I was hoping I would get to see um, Wano, but it, but, all the, but it makes sense that uh, he was wandering around outside of Wano because he ended up on Thriller Bark, you know, so I'm guessing obviously he's died, he's died somewhere that, 
Although, wait a minute, no, wait a minute, where did, I can't remember, I, I don't know if they mentioned it when the Gecko Moria was talking about how he got his zombie. Did they go back to Wano? I can't remember it. I can't remember it because he got, like, he must have went around collecting these, like, renowned figures because he had, like, Ryuma and then he had, um, what was his name? Uh, Captain John. Captain John that uh, Buggy was trying to get the treasure from and stuff like that and then like all the all the kind of general zombies so I don't I don't know but it's just it's nice to uh, it's nice to have that perception of him because I loved I loved Ryuma and Philip Bark like I said he was one of the highlights for me and his fight with Zoro loved it and the fact I just, I, I love the fact now that Zoro is carrying that sword. Just seeing that story and seeing the kind of person he was, um, and now, it, it, you know, it holds more weight for me now. I love that. Uh, you know, and I also, I love that his design was, was very close to, to Zoro's. Uh, you know, and it makes sense because of, obviously, what One Piece became. Because obviously Oda's had in mind for this character. Uh, and then it's probably translated that into Zoro being like the modern samurai uh, on the crew for uh, for the Straw Hats. That's great. Because I, I don't actually know. I know that there is like a one shot. Like this, you, you have this monsters and then there's another one with, I believe Luffy's still the same. But there's like different, it's, it's like different designs for the characters. And then obviously the Straw Hats maybe had like different designs going in. And certain characters weren't made. Because I think someone said that, was it Zoro? Was originally going to be part of Buggy's crew? God, that's, well, thank God that wasn't the case. <laughs> right? But, um, yeah, I loved that. It was just, the animation was a fantastic. Animation was great. Um, you know, it, it's, it got me excited for catching up uh, to One Piece because right now, obviously, I'm in Fishman Island, but the, the animation there compared to the East Blue, it's insane the jump, right? But when you think about it, how many years am I still behind? You know, because I'm basically only at like the halfway point, so I must still be like ten years or something behind. Like the current, the current uh, anime going on. Oh, okay, but yeah, has me excited for like the, how good the animation like will progress in the series. Um, obviously, I know this is a Netflix thing, so it's probably going to be different. You know, it might not be that good because you know it's like a they've done this for as like a Netflix thing. Uh, but yeah, fantastic, loved it. Love that, you know, that's just simple story, um, endears you to the character of Ryuma, uh, you know, just, uh, 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 he was a lot more, uh, what I like about that, obviously it's because he had Brook's shadow, um, so you couldn't get a full grasp of his personality, you know, the same with all the zombies, you know, it was, it was, that, was that was the case, but I like that it was a lot more kind of playful than I expected. I thought it was going to be like a serious, a serious samurai, but he had that cool side, but also like the, like, based, kind of like Zoro, kind of like Zoro. He's a badass, but at the same time, you know, he can have a laugh, have a joke, and he like has a, you know, has outbursts. Uh, I like that. So yeah, guys, really enjoyed it. Really enjoyed it. Um, I'm hoping that, let me know if, if there's been more of these that I don't know about. Like little side stories that I'm okay to watch. Obviously, please guys keep mind of spoils for me, um, because this was great because it was it was such a it was a prequel from a long time ago and it didn't ruin anything uh, beyond thriller back. So uh, that was great. If if there's anything else like that, let me know, guys. Um, but yeah, thanks so much for watching, guys. Uh, I'll see you in the next one. We'll be back in Fishman Island where we've just done the the flashback. So we'll, we've just seen Fisher Tiger and Otohime's story 
we'll be jumping out in the next episodes and that in the next video thanks so much for watching guys and i'll see you in the next one cheers bye